I love Sheffield. I love this game. Hey, what a way to bounce back from a humbling at Man City. And I put my hands up. We got embarrassed. I'm sure you'll all admit to that. And Blackburn fans giving us it. Fair enough, we would all do the same. It's not easy to go to City and do anything. And we didn't do anything, let's be real. And you know, Blackburn fans give us some fair stick. But lads, you've now just been beat by second in the championship. We got knocked out by probably the best team in the whole of Europe. You got knocked out by Sheffield United. There's levels to this shit. Honestly, fair play. They did decent for Blackburn. They had so many chances and to be fair, they scored eight, some brilliant goals, I guess. You could see the second one was very, very nice. Brilliant striker play and they deserve to be 2-1 up. Sorry, lads. I just wanted to say I'm going to have to be taking a few weeks off from the channel. I'm going to be presenting this lad right here with his trophy for scoring against the draw. They did lose, but I, I guess it's a good a achievement. Yeah. Anyways... Mo moving on. Ollie McBurney, I would let you have my children. Why are you gay? It's just funny, you know, seeing all the Blackburn fans that give us it yesterday, you know, paying 40 quid to go and watch us get beat by Man City. <laughs> You're hard. It's a sad little life, isn't it? And what's even better, you know, you did the whole oh, bye bye, yeah, nice one, mate. Banter, banter. You then got knocked out the next day after, you know, apparently going to Wembley after 70 minutes. How'd that one work out? Also, I know we can talk about all the outside stuff, but I want to focus on the game for a little bit. That Tommy Doyle strike is an absolute joke. How he's managed to nestle that in the top corner is ridiculous. After yesterday, my whole relations with Man City have been destroyed. Now I absolutely love them again. Please keep providing good players to anyone other than fucking Blackburn. Also, the refereeing in that game was dreadful on both sides. There was just fouls going in left, right and centre and he was just waving them away. It was ridiculous. But it didn't mean that Blackburn deserved anything. I thought it was a really even game. It was a good game, you know. Two mid-sides going at it. We genuinely make both of them look like a pub team. Like, we would have destroyed both of them teams if we got them in the cup. I know Sheffield United humbled us in November, but we've grown since then, and I genuinely think put us against them anytime soon. I know we've got Sheffield United not, not far around the corner, and we will leather both of them. Sheffield United is a team full of unbelievable individuals, genuinely. That team on paper should be flying through this league. But they're not as well coached. Burnley are brilliantly well coached by probably one of the best up-and-coming managers in the world. And I think if Sheffield United had company, it would be a completely different ball game in the championship. But moving on, let's go look at some tears. Inject it. You've got this girl. She seems a little bit upset, doesn't she? But what I think's more embarrassing, she's opened Snapchat. She's scrolled along a little bit. Oh, I like that filter. Let me take one. Oh, no, I don't actually look that good. I'll take another one. Ooh, that's good. I look lovely. Let me post that. What did she expect? Did she expect Burnley fans to go, Oh, I'm sorry, pet. I hope you're okay. No, of course you were going to get bullied. She got bullied so much, she deleted it within a minute. Lad, if you're going to post something like that, the game is the game. You've just got to take it on the chin. I mean, one of the more weirder things that we've done is, um, and I'm not going to say I didn't take part in it, but... Uh, Spamming pizza delivery orders in the in the Blackburn Twitter account comments. It's like it's it's weird even for us, okay? It's weird even coming from me. Did I take part? Absolutely, it's a it's funny, isn't it? <laughs> like, this is great banter. Not for Blackburn fans. Ollie McBurney, mate. Honestly, I have no words. I generally don't. I, I don't know what to say to him. I just love him. If I ever see Ollie McBurney in the streets, I will definitely. Give him a...